It is indeed an honor for Namibia to be hosting this year's regional adjudication committee meeting since SADC inception in 1980, the region has recorded a number of milestones which have contributed to the advancement of socio-economic development, political stability, and the consolidation of democracy within the continent. In 1995, the SADC Council of Ministers approved the establishment of the SADC Media Awards in order to recognize best media work being displayed within the region. The awards also encourages the media in the region to play a leading role in disseminating information in order to support the process of regional cooperation and regional integration. I'm informed that entries are in the categories of print, photo, radio, and television journalism. And I would like to urge you to critically analyze and crystallize these criteria in order to choose the best entry. I would further like to encourage you to be professional and fair so that the deserving and hardworking journalist will be rewarded for their exceptional work. Having gone through the National Adjudication Committee for scrutiny, shortlisted journalists are trusting you with adjudication that should be done fairly, as these journalists are hardworking towards the promotion of regional integration and socio-economic development for our region. Media coordinators in your respective member states, I urge you to continue ensuring that the public is well educated about the work that SADC does. Awareness creation is important as the information empowers citizens. I'm therefore pleased to learn that during this meeting, you will provide an update on what you as member states have done towards the implementation of the implementation plan for the SADC communication and promotional strategy of 2016 to 2020, which is meant to facilitate effective communication and promote our region. You will note that there is high level commitment to promote the brand and identity of SADC. This is why the SADC Councils of Ministers at their meeting in March this year, right here in Winduk, approved the singing of SADC anthem along with the national anthems and the wasting of the SADC flag alongside with the national flags in SADC meetings and events as one way of promoting SADC and its community building symbols. Consequently, I urge you to promote this initiative by hoisting the SADC flag along national flags and singing the SADC anthem along national anthems in your respective institutions and member states. I should, however, point to the fact 
<laughs> that this morning, very interestingly, I've been following with keen interest the movements of our bodies and our lips when the three anthems were being performed. And I would observe that only a very small quota of the delegates present here this morning were indeed active participants in the pronouncement of the lyrics and the chorus of these anthems. So I would like to encourage all and sundry, all of us, to take advantage of the fact that we should lead by example, by singing this anthem whenever they are being performed, and not to become passive observers. I'm pleased that in our midst, we are equally joined by editors or other media practitioners from various media institutions in Namibia who plays a major role in the dissemination of information that impacts the lives not only of Namibians but also that of the Sada community in general. Moreover, I would equally like to introduce To you, members from Namibia, the organizing committee, and those that are part of the adjudication committee, I have done that during my introduction already. However, let me point to Madam, your name is not appearing here. Nevertheless, Madam Elizabeth Muller. The chairperson. Can you maybe just rise quickly and let me see the yeah. Thank you. Mr. Herman Kangotri. <laughs> Elizabeth Amahola. <laughs> Monica Sifo Toka. <laughs> Tileni Mongudi. Absent. <laughs> and Tuevo. Njembela, from New Era. It's not here. Thank you very much for your continuous support, your guidance, and taking up time from your busy schedules to ensure that the NAC is operating successfully. And lastly, may I encourage you, our visiting delegates, in your free time to go out and experience Vinduk, what it is to offer, and equally to encourage you to socialize and mingle with the rank and file of the citizenry of the host capital of Vinduk. May you have a productive week ahead.